Hey guys, thanks for stopping in for another episode of I Want That Reviews. My name's Chris, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Little Boy Hex Break from Phase 5 Tactical. Now this is a smaller, more compact version of the full-sized Fat Man Hex Break. It's called the Hex Break, obviously, because of the hexagonal shape that it's got. Essentially, it's created to solve some issues that competition shooters and precision rifle builders face. It's specifically made to compensate and reduce the overall recoil that's felt by the shooter. Essentially, the design here allows the chamber wall to sit as close to the crown as possible to maintain accuracy. They advertise this as being mil-spec. Uh, I assume they mean it's mil-spec parkerized. I doubt you'll ever find one of these in the military or anywhere along those. But it is parkerized. It's uh, two and a half inches long one and a half inches wide, and it does come with a crush washer. Now, manufacturer suggested retail price on this is $99.99. I'm sure, as with any other parts, if you do some searching, you can find it for a little less than that, but that's essentially what you're looking at here. For my first impressions, the first thing I thought about it was, wow, it's big. Like, I knew it was going to be large, but when I pulled it out of the package and took a look at it, it, uh, it really kind of surprised me. It's, it's a lot larger than I was expecting to begin with, and uh, that's not necessarily a bad thing. I noticed right off the bat that it's extremely well machined. The, uh, it looks like it's laser cut. Uh, I can't find any tooling marks on it at all. Very even parkerized finish. And uh, I noticed that it threads over your barrel. So your, uh, it, it actually slides over the end of your barrel, threads down, and your crown comes almost to the end of that expansion chamber in there. So that's something to keep in mind. This will not work if you're looking at running a, uh, a 14 and a half inch barrel. Even if you pin and weld this, it will not be long enough. So this is not an option for you. As far as use, um, it was super easy to install, like any other flash hider. The, I mean, the whole thing is uh, is a hex, so I mean, you put a wrench right on it and uh, and torque it down, and it's good to go. Now, it looked kind of funny on my rifle. Uh, reason being, it's uh, <laughs> you know, you you thread it onto here, and you've kind of got this gap where uh, where there's some space, and uh, then you've got your large uh, compensator on there. It works extremely well. I definitely did notice a reduction in recoil. I would say it's uh, maybe not quite half as much as it is normal, but it definitely does reduce that. There's also a hole in the top there to mitigate muzzle rise, so it makes those follow-up shots faster. So as far as likes go, I love the design. I love the shape. Uh, I really like the fact that it threads over your barrel and gives you an even more, an even shorter look. If you're running a 16 inch barrel and a 15 inch rail, you can tuck this back under your rail and give it that look of a, of a 14 and a half inch rifle. It really looks good and it's just a nice piece. As far as dislikes, I didn't like the fact that it won't work for a 14 and a half inch build. That's a very tailored position, so it's not something that's going to affect everybody. That's just something that I thought. Uh, if you want that to work, if you want it to be something that'll work for that, look at the uh, look at the Fat Man. Uh, that's long enough that you could tack and weld that on there, and you'd be just fine. But besides that, I really don't have any dislikes. This one's going to earn a full five out of five stars. It's not for this rifle, but it's going to go on a pistol build that I'm working on, and then I'm going to form one it and uh, and do an SBR. And so it's going to look fantastic once it's done. Uh, I'm very happy with it. I would highly recommend it. As always, I'll include a link to their website as well as their Facebook page in the description below. Go ahead and take a look and see if you're interested in anything they've got. I want to take just a moment to say thank you. We just cleared 500 subscribers and I couldn't have done it without you guys. You know, this started out as a real small hobby for me and it's slowly gaining momentum. It's uh, gaining altitude. I'm excited to see what's happening and, and I appreciate you all being with me for it. So please hang in here. Keep coming back every week. I'm going to keep bringing you more reviews of awesome products just like this one and make you say, I want that.